click the bell icon to get latest videos from ekida hello friends we'll be solving now one question based on primary distribution of overheads we are required to remember one thing that direct wages of production departments are not overheads but all expenses of service department will be treated as overheads that means direct wages in case of service department is also treated as overheads let us read the question the modern company is divided into four departments a b c are production departments and d is service department the actual cost for a particular period for a period is given below rent 10000 repairs to plant 6000 depreciation on plant 4500 supervision 1500 fire insurance of stock 5000 power 9000 light 1000 employers insurance liability 15000 the following information are available in respect of four departments they have given area in square feet 1500 1100 900 and 500 we can get the ratio fifteen is to eleven is to nine is to five number of employees twenty fifteen ten and fifteen twenty is to fifteen is to ten is to fifteen horsepower of machines. Eight hundred, five hundred, two hundred. Total wages sixty thousand, forty thousand, thirty thousand, and twenty thousand. Here we have actual amount. Value of plant two lakh forty thousand, one lakh eighty thousand, one lakh twenty thousand, and sixty thousand. Four is two, three is two, two is two, one. Value of stock one lakh fifty thousand, ninety thousand, sixty thousand. So it will be five is to three is to two. These expenses will not be there in case of service department. Light points forty, thirty, twenty, and ten. Four is to three is to two is to one. Apportion the cost of various department by the most equitable method. we are required to divide all these expenses based on this information first we have rent which will be allocated on the basis of area occupied by these departments a b c d in square feet it is given and we got the ratio next we have repairs to plant this will be allocated based on cost of machinery value of plant 2 lakh 40000 1 lakh 80000 1 lakh 20000 and 60000 we got the proportion 4 is to 3 is to 2 is to 1 next we have depreciation of plant depreciation of plant will be divided based on cost of machineries so we'll have same ratios over here supervision it will be allocated based on number of employees ratio we have 
20 is to 15 is to 10 is to 15. Fire insurance of stock 5000. This will be based on value of stock 5 is to 3 is to 2. Power 9000. It will be based on light points. Lighting based on light points. Power 9000. It will be based on horsepower of machines. We have the ratio 8 is to 5 is to 2. Lighting will be based on light points that is 4 is to 3 is to 2 is to 1. Employers insurance liability. It will be based on number of employees. Employee wages. Total wages are already allocated on actual basis. Let us divide these expenses based on the ratios. 10,000 will be allocated in this ratio. Six thousand will be divided in this ratio. Depreciation on plant will be divided in the same ratio. Supervision 1500 in the ratio of number of employees. Fire insurance of stock. It will be divided in the ratio of 5 is to 3 is to 2 only between A, B and C department because D department is a service department not having any stock. Power, it is based on horsepower. It will not be there in case of service department D. So we have divided all expenses on equitable basis. We can have total of this to arrive at overheads of each department. The share of overheads for department A 22,150, department B 15,075, department C 10,000 and department D 24,775. So in this question we have learned how to allocate overheads between three production departments and one service department. Thanks for watching this video. Stay in tune with Ikeda and subscribe to our channel Ikeda. Thank you.